Hey everybody, I am so glad you came because today it's a big day. I mean, it's such a big, big day. Do you know what today is? Today we're gonna talk about Jesus, but today we're all gonna celebrate something that happened to Jesus. Well, I mean, it wasn't all good. I mean, there was, there was some bad things that kind of happened to Jesus, but then God showed up and God helped Jesus and it turned out to be an amazing day. Matter of fact, it turned out to be the best day ever. And so today, instead of just jumping right into the lesson, I thought we should start off with a worship song. Yeah, because that's the kind of day today is. Now, also, because such, today is such an exciting day, I think it would be wise uh, for you and your parents first to do a little bit of stretching, okay? So here we go. The first stretch is we're gonna touch our toes. You ready? Here we go. Ready? Hands up high. Ready to go down low, all the way to the toes. One, two, three. Wow, that was harder than I thought. Okay, I can do it, I can do it. Okay, okay, are, are, you, are you ready? One, two, three. Touch your toes. One, two, three. Are you? How are you doing that all the way down? That's amazing. Okay, good. Okay, good. I'm so proud of you. The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna do some some uh, some arm stretches. Okay, some arm stretches to a clap because this is important worship activity. Okay, ready? Arms out wide, together. Apart, together. Apart. Together. Now do it fast. Don't fly away. Okay. That was good. Okay, now just jump in place. All right, here we go. Now we're going to jump in to our very first worship song. Mom and Dad, try to keep up. There are some motions in this song, and I want you guys to watch and learn the motions and then do them. Okay? Here we go. God loves us and he gave his only son He is awesome, Jesus Nothing can stop him, he's too strong Yeah, we're singing Jesus is alive, he's alive, oh yeah Everybody celebrate Jesus is alive, he's alive, oh yeah He can do
Wow, that was so much fun. I love worshiping Jesus and singing songs about him because today is an amazing day. We celebrate Jesus doing something amazing. And we're going to learn all about it in our story today. But first, I want to remind you about a very important verse. It's out of the book of Revelations. It's the very last, last book in the Bible. And in that, Jesus says something very important. We all need to remember what Jesus says. He said at the end of the Bible, he says, I am alive forevermore. That means Jesus is not dead. He's not going to die ever, ever, ever. He says, I am alive forevermore. Can you guys say that with me? Let's all say it together on the count of three, okay? One, two, three. I am alive forevermore. That's what Jesus says, and that is the truth, boys and girls. And we are going to hear about an amazing story today. So sit back and get excited and watch today's story. Who? Who? Know what time it is? It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun. I planted flower seeds in this flower pot and it just won't come up. It's been months. Okay, it's been days. But still, I thought for sure a flower would have popped up by now. But no, not even one tiny little sprout. How am I going to keep waiting? It feels like I've been waiting for years and years. Are you ever going to grow? Where is it? Is it even alive in there? Who? Who? Hey, it's Ollie. Hello, Lucy. Who? Who? Waiting on a flower to grow, are you? Ollie, I don't know. How am I going to wait any longer? I'm not even sure this flower is even alive. Waiting for things to happen is hard, it's true. I know some others who waited too. So let's hear this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Happy Easter, friends! <laughs> I'm so glad you're here. I've been waiting for you. I'm so excited about our Bible story today because it's the true story of Easter and why we're celebrating. Do you want to help me build it? Haha, <laughs> great! Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer! Ha-ha! <laughs> Great job, little helpers! You can put your hammers down. Now, we just need our story tools. Yep, that's perfect! Now, let me just paint something really quick. See if you can guess what it is. Okay, do you know what it is? Yes! A heart! Because the true story of Easter begins with God's love for us. Give yourself a big hug. Oh. <laughs> God loves us so much that he sent his son Jesus to be our friend forever. That's right. God sent his son Jesus to be our friend forever. But first, something sad had to happen. 
One night, when Jesus was having dinner with his friends, the disciples, he told them he would have to go away, but he said he would come back. After dinner, Jesus went to pray in a garden. Then some angry people came and took Jesus away. They hurt Jesus and he died. It was very sad. All of Jesus' friends were so sad. Can you show me your sad face? They put Jesus' body in a tomb with a big stone in front of it. Three sad days went by. Can you count them with me? One, two, three. Then, look! On the third day, when some of Jesus' friends went to the tomb, they saw that the stone had been rolled away and Jesus was not there. Then came the good news. Jesus came back, just like he said he would. Jesus is alive! Jesus is alive! Woohoo! Party time! Jesus is alive! Ho -ho! On Easter, we celebrate that Jesus is alive and he wants to be our friend forever. <laughs> Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who is alive? Jesus is alive. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who is alive? Jesus is alive. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Happy Easter! Oh, Jesus is alive. So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus is alive, and he wants to be a friend to you and you, and you. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, Jesus' friends were so sad, but then Jesus came back, just like he said he would. Jesus is alive. It's the most amazing thing ever. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Got it! Good. I'm so glad Jesus is alive. Happy Easter, everyone. Ooh, look, look, look. My little plant is alive. Yeah, it's alive. Uh-huh, mm-hmm, it's alive. Wow. What an amazing story. I mean, can you imagine what Jesus went through? Those mean, angry men did such mean things to him. And he even died because of what they did. But then God, God stepped in and raised Jesus from the dead. That is amazing. And because of what God did, Jesus can say, I am alive forevermore. Let's say that again because that is just such good news. On the count of three. One, two, three. I am alive forevermore. And when we know that Jesus lives, we can understand that God is going to help us too. Thank you so much for watching today. I hope today is an amazing day for you as we continue to celebrate the resurrection of Jesus Christ. Mom and Dad, thanks for watching. And if you want any more activities or resources, just look in the description below and there is a link. It is calvary.online slash kid resources. And there you go, we will find a link to some preschool activities that will give you some things that you can continue the conversation at home. There's some coloring pages, there's some uh, simple activities you can do just to kind of carry on the fun. And don't forget, you can also download the ParentQ app. That gives you some amazing insight into the stories um, that we've just talked about and that are coming, but it will give you some great ways to uh, cement these ideas into our kids' minds through some activities while we're driving, while we're sitting at the table for dinner, uh, while we're putting our kids to bed, and even during bath times, those moments where we are truly connecting with our kids. There's some great things that we can do during those connection moments. So thanks again, guys, for watching. 